program supports opportunities and services for people with disabilities in my area grow. It has been amazing to benefit from this growth. I've been able to find my many home away from homes and therapists who are wonderful. I've met amazing friends too. This is what I want for Port Clinton. This is one reason why I support Pathway Inclusion Center. Pathways will serve as so many different things for different people in Port Clinton area. An inclusive daycare center, therapy center, place to go to summer camp, place for parents to come for support groups and workshops, and more. But most importantly, it will be a place where people of all abilities are welcome. It will be a place where families can go for support and information. A place where kids with disabilities can go to learn, grow, and have fun, and learn that they are not alone. And a place for siblings and kids without disabilities to go and be included as well, because they are just as important. I imagine that it is scary when a parent first hears that their child is different. They may feel at a loss. They may start to lose hope. They may sit through meetings and appointments where they are told what their kid will never do. Let me just tell you, no one can predict the future. No one has a crystal ball. You have to ride the, w the waves of life to find out what the future holds. Pathways is going to help lead parents towards a path of hope and support to let them know that they are not alone. Please, can you help us build this path that is Pathway Inclusion Center? Pathways will be a place for families to turn, for support, for a shoulder to lean on. Pathways will provide that twinkle of hope just when one may start to think of it as a long lost dream. Pathways will also serve as an opportunity for inclusion and teaching other kids that it is indeed okay to be different, a place where they can be taught how, how to approach their peers because honestly, we, we cannot expect kids to just know. Sometimes I think that it must be scary for kids without, without disabilities who want to approach their peers who are different than them, but simply don't know how. Pathways will be a path to help facilitate this. I imagine that it is hard to stay strong sometimes, especially when you may feel like there's a lack of support and resources available. Pathways will help fill this gap so that parents will be able to be there for their kid fighting and advocating for them at a time when they aren't able to. I imagine that there are moments as a parent when you want to cry because you just want to help your child, but it is so hard to do so when resources and supports are limited. And when your child's ability to tell you what they want and need may be limited, may be limited. you are not alone. Pathways is going to help, sh help show you this. Pathways is going to lead you to hope. Now I want to tell you about mentors. Having individuals with autism as mentors has changed my life for the better. It has given me hope at a time when I'm starting to lose hope. It has led me on a path to helping others. Pathways will be a place where kids can find friends and mentors, a place where they can learn they are not alone. There are other people going through similar things, things like they are, and that everything is going to be all right. Not only have I had the experience to be mentored by other adults who have autism, I've had the experience to mentor and be friends with younger individuals who have autism. It has been so amazing to give back. One little girl that I have the great opportunity of mentoring and being her friend has taught me so much. I have n never read or heard the typed words of any 10-year-old, let alone one who is nonverbal and has only been typing via facilitated communication for less than three years. She has blown me away. Um, it's just another proof that anything's possible when you don't give up hope. Um, she typed that I saved her from loneliness. This is why we need pathways, to make a difference, to change the world, and most importantly, change a family and child's life and impact it for the better. I hope that this is something that can be done at Pathways. This is just another reason why Port Clinton needs Pathways and Pathways needs you. Now I would like to tell you a story. So I'm at the Pathways wheel of time. Maybe you, you were there too. It was loud and fun, but could have been seen as overwhelming for some people with sensory differences. I saw that Carrie's daughter, Karis, who is six years old, was becoming overwhelmed and upset. I offered Karis my own noise-canceling headphones that I bought 
since I didn't need them and she left hers at home. But I did more than just let her borrow my headphones. What happened next was truly amazing. I saw Karis getting more overwhelmed and I offered to take her on a walk. Who would have thought that she'd come? We barely knew each other. But sure enough, she came. We walked, we stood. I supported her at a time when she needed someone who had been there to just be there. I stood, I stood by there as she walked in the midst of the overwhelm, and I knew what she was going through. I had been in her shoes. I know what the feeling of overwhelm feels like. It was the, this moment that will stay with me forever. It is a moment that I hope stays with you forever as well. It is one moment of many that explains why poor Clinton needs pathways, and pathways need you. We need to provide these kinds of experiences and opportunities for more children, but we, we cannot do it alone. We need your help. Please help us make this dream a reality. Thank you. Anything is possible. And I'd also like to thank Karen and Stacy for letting me speak and for letting me be on their advisory council. It's been an amazing journey, and Carrie has been so helpful beyond words. There would be a photo of me and her two kids at the aqua at, at the aquarium, but when you have th three kids with, with, with autism, or three individuals with, with autism running in three different directions at the aquarium, <laughs> there is not a picture. <laughs> so, we, we were, but she was such a blessing. I was starting to get overwhelmed. It was just my mom and I, and but her mom was there, so her mom and my mom could stay at the raffle tickets, and she took the three of us to the aquarium. That was braver than brave to do it by yourself, <laughs> but in barely knowing each other, we, we've known each other for less than two, two, two years maybe, and it's been an amazing friendship. I greeted her tonight and said, Miss Karis and Kai, and then have meal toys, because I know she stocks them, that, them up, and that's my obsession. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs>